Hello everyone. Uh, this is just to briefly uh, show you something that I plan to do with this pathetic looking um, soldering gun from Weller. It's a model D550. And the story behind this uh, soldering gun is that I was in a Hempfest in New Jersey in the month of July 2021 and I happened to uh, buy a junior Weller uh, soldering gun from a gentleman there. Uh, not this one, but something which looked extremely similar to this one. And as we started talking, I asked him, does he have anything a little more uh, better or with more wattage than the junior Weller? And he said he does, but uh, he doesn't, he, he didn't think that I would be interested. Uh, he showed me this soldering gun <clears throat> which is a d550 model weller and it's all broken up the case is all broken and it's held up by scotch tape or uh, you know some kind of tape plastic tape insulating tape um, it is missing one uh, bulb here and i believe the bulb which is there is also not working fused and the tip was all mangled and broken up and the gentleman said that if if I want it, he will just give it to me for a dollar. He didn't know if this gun is going to work or not. So I said, I mean, what's the big deal? I'll just take my chances. And I paid him a dollar and I got it. Uh, when I brought it home, I basically uh, put a copper wire between these and, and tested it. And sure enough, the wire was heating up okay. So that told me that I'll be able to actually use this gun uh, somewhat although the the case is all broken up and it's nothing short of a dead trap um, I thought I would be able to uh, build a tip for 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 uh, this soldering gun using a copper wire like I did for my junior Weller gun which is an older version that I have um, I was not I, I was questioning myself, did I <laughs> spend that one buck wisely or not? Uh, but then I started to look online and I found that several places were selling replacement body for, um, for this particular gun. But surprisingly, every place I tried, they were out of stock. It was shown as out of stock. And one place actually uh, took my order and then... Uh, cancel the order after uh, uh, one week and uh, basically I got a phone call and they told me that um, the manufacturer or the supplier no longer supplies this part. Um, I almost gave up but then I came across a particular a surplus electronic place called Marvac and they had two in stock and I just jumped on the chance and I basically um, ordered uh, the replacement body plastic body for this one and just few days ago this is what i got this is from mar -Wack electronics and this is the replacement body for this um, soldering gun i plan to to restore this gun using this uh, body new body and I will build a new tip like I discussed just now. And um, I will also look for the new bulbs for this. This particular gun, as well as some other Weller soldering guns, use uh, uh, 222 number bulbs, number 222 bulbs, which are easy to come by. So I should not have any problem. So I'm going to cut open this tape, remove this body, and I'm going to install this new... Uh, new body and then uh, I'll see how it functions. Uh, the only difference between this original body and the new one is that it does not have the logo of Weller here. As you can see the old gun had the Weller logo. So I'll keep it posted, let me cut it open and I'll put the new body on and then I'll show you how it came out. Here's the body. Uh, I have removed the top cover and uh, you can see and uh, 
I'm going to remove the bottom one also and then I will try to fit in the innards into a new uh, plastic body and see how it goes. So uh, there you have it for folks. I have uh, replaced the body and it seems to fit perfectly well. I had to struggle a little bit uh, in trying to fit it but I didn't have to cut or break anything and it was basically my fault that I wasn't trying to I wasn't setting this switch and its assembly here well uh, but once um, I played with it a little bit it came out perfect so as you can see I got a brand new gun once I put uh, well not brand new at least uh, what do you what do you expect for a buck and once I'm gonna put the uh, the, the tip here and uh, change the the bulbs um, I will have a pretty decent high voltage uh, gun this D 550 is actually 240 watt uh, soldering iron uh, soldering gun so it is pretty good for uh, soldering to the chassis which uh, unfortunately my junior a uh, junior weller which is I think about 140 watts is unable to do I would even see if I can remove the uh, logos or stickers from this old assembly and put them right here to make it uh, like a fake uh, renewed body. Uh, well, um, the lesson learned is that if you see a soldering gun being sold for a dollar, take it. Uh, you may never know. Uh, good luck and hopefully you find something equally good and useful. Thank you.